I'm interested in how animals interact with their environment. So whether it's a whale or a dolphin, there's got to be a reason why they're there. And what environmental factors might influence that? Massachusetts Bay is a really important place. It's a really important ecosystem. To truly understand Massachusetts Bay, we need to understand how dolphins use that environment. The hazards that many marine wildlife face, whether it's a whale, a basking shark, a tuna, they all face the same issues. Noise pollution. There's lots of ship traffic, there's lots of fishing, there's lots of fishing gear. And sometimes dolphins can interact with that human activity that can potentially harm them. I started volunteering as an intern, like Tammy. Back in the 1980s, there were no women crew. As I had one owner tell me, women belong in the booth selling tickets, in the galley selling food, or in the kitchen or in the bedroom. That's it. They don't belong on deck. So I had to fight. The first step is actually going through all of those recordings. We listen to a lot of the files, but we also using a sound analysis program to actually look at the recordings too. Why should we care about dolphins? Dolphins are top predators on the food chain. Every animal has its place in the environment. Ultimately, the way that we impact dolphins will eventually come back to affect humans. I don't worry about Tammy. Tammy is an incredible professional. She's involved, she's doing research, she's using that research for conservation. Being at a desk every day and at a computer can be a little hard, but as soon as you get out on the ocean and you see the animals and the view and the experience, you remember why it's all worth it and why you do what you do.